All right, everyone, you are welcome on my channel. As usual, we are still at the Kantanga Tech Expo 2022, and we are here at the table of Accra Technical Training Center. They've been able to invent marvelous stuff here that I would like to talk to them about. I think they've done what they call um, Bluetooth speaker. So I would like to talk to them for them to explain the purpose of their work and what the purpose of their work stands to do to help Mother Africa progress in technology. All right, so welcome to our channel. Please, you may mention the name of your team, your school, or whatever you have, and we start talking. Okay, my name is Samuel Abwaje, and I'm from uh, a student from Accra, it is uh, Accra Technical Training Center. Okay, so first of all, we would like to know, uh, these inventions done by yourself, a team or your school that you are represented uh, It's done by a team. A team? Yes. Those who are here? Yes. Or the two of you alone? Yes. Okay. Two. Or the two of you. Right. So now let's start talking about your invention. What have you done? Uh, I've done a, a vacuum cleaner and also... So uh, this is a vacuum yes. cleaner? Yes. Can you demonstrate how it works? Yeah. We, we, uh, you have to plug it before. This is the adapter for the vacuum cleaner. Okay. And, and the voltage is 12, 12, 12 voltage. voltage. Yes. Okay. And the motor is also 12. So you have to plug it before it. Okay. So when you plug it, and so uh, just press the switch here. Okay. And just collect the, the rubbish. The oh, okay. Here for the rubbish. You have to dump it. Open here and dump it. Once it has collected the rubbish, you have to dump the rubbish. Okay. So you will then put it inside it. Okay. So this actually works. Yes. Okay, so we are demonstrating how it works. I think the vacuum cleaner works with pressure. So Oh wow. So Depending on the kind of pressure that it has currently, it's able to pick uh, rubbers and, and a lot of stuff. Look at what they are, were able to use the, the cleaner to clean so far. Bravo to their marvelous. These are genius minds. Okay, I think that's, that, that's okay, you've proven yourself. Put the camera on me, please. So, our people here have been able to do vacuum cleaner. You see, those, are, those of us that we use, uh, woolen carpet in our rooms, right? When it gets that, it's very difficult for you to sweep. So this, our youngsters have been able to invent a vacuum cleaner that when you press the switch, as you have connected to electricity source, then it's able to pull the dust into its source. So if you want to go and empty it, they've made a space under it, here, where you open it up and you dump your trash. Okay, so now let's come to the Bluetooth speaker. Uh, okay, this is also a Bluetooth speaker made okay. with uh, plastic, a bucket. Okay. Bucket. And a bucket, plastic bucket, and, and a wood. Yes. Okay. Uh, this is the motherboard that I bought, uh, and I use it to build this. Uh, it's connected to a, to a five volt battery. Five volt battery. battery. So this is the charging port. So it, uh, wow. Charge. Okay. So this is the power source. Yeah, and we have uh, a speaker also. Uh, the speaker is under. What about this side? A thick case and a base. Oh, okay. Okay. So now let's test your speaker. Okay. So it's on. So they are changing station. That's a radio frequency. Oh, okay. So are you able to connect this to your phone? You said it's a Bluetooth speaker. speaker. Wow. Alright, so it's working. And this thing is made out of plastic buckets and wood. That's, that's innovative. Imagine we've been using our buckets and throwing them away all the time. These youngsters are telling you that they can recycle our, our buckets at homes into Bluetooth speakers. So when we are doing all these things, what we are telling our government is that 
when the opportunity is given to the youngsters like this, they will prove themselves that they are also worthy of living in this world. They are not trash like people want us to believe that the African mind has been dead, long dead and buried years back. These African youngsters trained in Africa, even though their school system is not good enough, they are still able to do something. So just imagine if our government positions itself in a way that our youngsters will be trained the way that technology needs to be done. You can imagine the progress already. Look at these beautiful things that are being exhibited here today by African youngsters. So let me talk to you. What's your motivation for doing this? Uh, I, uh, I want to read my, uh, the ideas that I got using this packet to, is to prevent uh, plastic waste. Uh, I was disturbed by uh, plastic waste in my community. So, okay. so I decided to build a Bluetooth speaker that to recycle, uh, uh, to recycle the plastic, plastic waste use. Bluetooth speakers. Yes. Let's talk a bit to your colleague. So, you leave me out. Mention okay. your name too. My name is Agbo Davis from Accra Technical Training Center. We also, we also have the Bluetooth and then this is a radio. It's the same, this one, but this one we use gallon to make it. So actually this one can be charged, it also has a pen drive and you can also connect it to other this one, speakers so that you can amplify the sound. So you would want to... So this one is chargeable? Yes, it's chargeable. Wow. Wow. Bluetooth mount. Bluetooth mode. Okay. So FM mount. Are you meaning to do this with the guy? What can you start with? You mean? Okay. Uh, Last year, yeah, I have something you win. Yeah, this year, I have a power for this year, 2022. Radio. <laughs> that is what night. Uh huh. Okay, so this one today use uh, uh, gal uh, gallon. Yes. What we call here, the one we use to store oil. And uh, is it VC pipe? Yes. So if you even look at the way they did their regulator, you can see these youngsters are improvising because they don't have resources. Right? They are starved of resources, but they are still being able to use their minds, their brains. To use wood as pressable stuff, uh, is it something like a remote control to change the frequency? That's marvelous. These are geniuses, right? You see, what I like to see about our youngsters is that even when the things are not there, they are still creating something. They are still forcing themselves to do something. These are people that we need to promote. So if you are some, if you are here in Ghana, you have the money to promote these people. You know what they can do. I beg you, please, take them up, nurture them. In the future, they will be your money-making machines. Please, is there any number that you can put out for people to reach you? Any number at all? 0247. Okay, so if you have the capacity to help these our youngsters, please do. Help them for us. The future is bright if you are willing to take them up and help them become better, better versions of themselves. All right, so we will leave you here and go to a different, other th many things. Let's move to the other table. All right, so I can see something like solar, solar panel. So, talk to us. Okay, here we have the solar water heater. So solar water, water heater. heater, yes. Okay. So the solar water heater is used to heat up water using the solar energy of the, the sun. So, first we have the solar um, water heater has three components. That's the supply tank, your panel, the heater panel, and then the water storage tank. Okay. So, this, let's say for example, here's your tab or your tag your tank where you start up your cold water okay so you then open the tap and the water flows into the compartment okay the heater panel has been is placed on top of your building so this is just a miniature of your house clinic mm -hmm. your, any building any kind okay. of building so when the water settles in the sun radiation 
gets into the compartment through radiation, then the compartment gradually becomes heated, okay. which in turn see the copper tubings. The reason why we use copper is because copper is a good conductor of heat. So once the water, the water also takes up the um, the heat of the this one, the copper cores. Okay. Then it gradually loses its density. Then it flows upwards. Then through the outlet, then it gets into the storage tank. Okay. The our storage tank we made it locally. We made we designed it in such a way that the temperature of the water in the storage tank would be um, retained for long periods. Okay. So that we don't the heat loss would be minimized. So use something like heat insulator. Yes. Okay. So like something like a, a vacuum fly, something, something okay. like that. So we've also provided the backup system. The backup system is just an adapt in case the, the hot water it becomes cold. So in a case where there is not enough sunlight or um, night time, you can use the temperature control unit. The temperature control unit has two main purposes. It's to detect the temperature of the water and also to heat up the water through the DC heater. Okay. So this thing is powered by a 12 volt battery and then the solar panel. So this project basically depends on purely on solar, nothing else. Okay, then so wait. So aside heating the water here, if the water is transported to the storage, yes. there is this backup system here to still heat it in yes. case it's going cold. Yes. Wow. Wow. So no matter what, you will still get hot, hot water. water. That's very good. You, you've really done your thinking. And yet we have the solar cooker. Solar cooker? Yes. Cooking what? It's used to cook plantain, we've used it to cook rice, then we used to um, dry this one, yam. yam. Dry yam? Yes. Okay. So this one is used during the day, likewise this one. Okay. But this one can be used during the day and then because of the backup system. Okay. So in this case, the sun radiation will fall onto the aluminum foil. The aluminum foil will direct the sun rays into the compartment. If you could see, um, notice the compartment in here, it has been painted black. Yes. And inside too, um, it's metal. It's a metal. In here, it's a metal. Meanwhile, here it was um, wood, and here it was um, painted white. Yeah. The reason we painted it black is to absorb and retain it so that the compartment become very mm -hmm. hot. Mm -hmm. So the, um, the food that you put inside will later become hot and then you need to cook the food for you. So you just put your food inside? Yes. And it starts cooking? Yes. Whoa. Have you, is this in the, uh, on the market already? Oh no, no. So this is the first of its kind? Yes. yes. Wow. Well, I haven't seen it before, that's why I'm asking. Okay, so put it on me. So let me give another explanation of what they've, they've done, in case you didn't get it right. What they've done here is to design water heater to be used in our hospitals and in our homes. All right, so water is stored, send it here. Water is stored in this water supply tank, and then it's transported to be heated here. When the heating is done, it's also transported into this reservoir, or uh, let me say a storage system, where there's another backup heater here. In case the water here is going cold, this one rejuvenates the heating. And you open the tap here and use, or you fetch the water and go and use it for whatever you want to use it for. Now here is our solar panel that's supporting this whole engineering. This is the solar panel supporting this whole engineering. And this, the solar panel is only supporting the backup system. That's this. this okay. Thing. Okay. So this one. So, uh, so this one does not depend on the solar. It depends on what? It depends on the sun's energy, but not on the solar panel. Oh, so this one is able to pick the sun energy direct. Yes. And this one is direct. Oh, okay. So this one with or without light, the, the heating will work. With, with the sun, the presence of sun, sun, okay, and to heat. But in case they say this one during the night time, or you've gone for a ah, night, during night time, it's going cold. Uh -huh. Then the backup system will reheat it. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, okay. And here is a cooker, um, a solar cooker, where this traps the sunlight and throws it to the uh, black paint inside. Yes, inside um, the invention. 
and then whatever food you put inside it begins to get cooked. I would like a demonstration, but uh, it's unfortunate that we don't have enough sunlight here, to, and I didn't bring also any food for us to test it. Anyway, is there any other thing you've done? Yes. Stand here. Okay. Okay, uh, this is uh, another invention uh, project. Uh, it's called uh, um, uh, electronic. It's called electronic motor made with uh, wood, and also and also it's powered by solar panels, and also we can charge by electricity. So the motorbike is powered by solar. Solar and, and also it's also chargeable. Yes. Okay. Okay. Does it have batteries? Yes, it has battery, uh, two batteries, motor, motor battery two, so motor battery one is 12 volts and the two will make uh, 24 volts and also the solar panel is also 24 volts, so it's, uh, the solar panel is able to charge the main battery. Is it, it okay, so is it possible that you make it move right now for us to see? No, I, I have a problem with the back tie. The back tie? Yes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, at least I'm still happy. Looking at the way they've used the screws and wood to be able to mold it into, it, it looks like a delivery bike. Okay, so this bike will deliver goods and you don't need to spend your money on fuel. You know the fuel brouhaha we have in this country nowadays? Fuel keeps going up and, and, and up. People are happy that it's coming down, but we know that nothing comes down forever. It will still go up someday. So if you have this in your home or in your company that you are using, whether there is some sunlight or there is electricity, you can use your motorbike and go and deliver goods to Jumia, wherever. All right, so is this your last invention? In fact, you guys are marvelous. I'm happy to meet you. Uh, you say your name is? Sam. Samuel. 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 Okay, so put down the number again. Maybe someone forgot the number. 0249. 0249 uh, 79 79 26 26 78 78 in case someone wants to take you and provide you a better environment nurture you better and make you better versions of yourself sponsor you to create these things for markets are you willing yes please. so they are willing so if you have the money these are good ventures to invest in i haven't seen this before on the market before if these youngsters are able to bring this out for the market I will be willing to buy and use. All right, thank you. Let me move to other tables and let's see what others have been able to make.